feature of the new Chevrolet is its remarkable riding and handling ease. In the city, on the highway, around the sharpest curves, over the roughest roads. In a new Chevrolet, you get the safest, most stable, most comfortable ride you've ever known. The reason is modern engineering. To Chevrolet, that means simpler designs of parts and components so they work better and last longer. The new Chevrolet chassis is a classic example. Its outstanding performance is largely built around two simple principles engineered to operating perfection. First, for all around strength, nothing is structurally better than a box. This is just ordinary cardboard, but because it's shaped into a box design, it easily supports the weight of a 200 pound man. Let's see how this design is used in the new Chevrolet. The box girder frame is a famous Chevrolet first, but in its new design, it is 50% more rigid than ever before. One reason is that the various box sections of the frame are bigger and wider. Another reason is that with straighter side members and stronger front and rear cross member attachments, the entire frame is virtually a rectangular box. But here's the main reason. A completely new design for the important front suspension cross member. In the 1954 frame construction, the front cross member was a separate unit. The front suspension was attached to this cross member. Then the unit was bolted to the frame. It was good engineering. But Chevrolet engineers had a better idea. The front cross member is built right into the new Chevrolet frame. Precision drilling spots the attachment points for the front suspension. Then you've got what they call an integrated unit. Much stronger and much more stable. This simply means you don't have to worry about taking your new Chevrolet over wicked roads. The world's toughest test roads have already proved that. And here's more proof. You get plenty of extra strength and stability in the new Chevrolet. Now, where else in the new Chevrolet frame can we use the natural strength of the box? Well, here's an important place at the frame end. At both front and rear, the new bumper attachments make box-like structures with new strength and rigidity. And again, where most cars have a second cross member, the new Chevrolet has another kind of box. It's a unique structural arch called a plenum chamber. And it helps bind the body to the chassis in a new and stronger way. These additional boxes give you additional benefits. The new structural arch makes an added contribution to greater riding and handling ease. The other hidden boxes in the new bumper design give you extra protection against careless drivers. How much? Watch closely. This regular production new Chevrolet has no special reinforcement of any kind. And here's the result. Just front end sheet metal damage. In the new Chevrolet, there's plenty of extra strength for your safety and protection inside the car. That's how important the simple box can be. Now let's see how resourceful modern engineering can be with another simple principle. Nothing is easier to move around than a ball. And a ball can move in one direction as easily as another. The new Chevrolet front suspension takes full advantage of this principle. Here is true ball suspension. Two balls are used in place of the usual hinge-type connections at these joints. 
The new ball joint is more durable and more trouble-free. Its new flexibility permits elimination of old-fashioned kingpins, and it leads to other important design changes. First, the front coil springs and shock absorbers are now inclined toward the center of the car. 